<laughs> good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Good evening. I'm good. Thank you. Welcome back to the good jungle. Evening, everybody. It's good to see you again. How was your weekend? I fine, thank you. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening, Good evening, Arnoldo. Good evening. Good evening, Jonathan. How are you? Good evening. Good evening, Jonathan. It's good to see you again. Yes. Back in class. Okay. So we are at the last week for this module. That's great. <clears throat> okay, did you finish all the exercises for section three? I just remember one or two that maybe didn't finish. Ah, espero que sí, todos ya estén al día con sus actividades de la plataforma. Y que ya comiencen y avancemos con la sección 4. También se les envió un mensaje por ahí para que estén pendientes con recursos humanos en sus compañías con la documentación, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes. Para que no se atrase el inicio del siguiente módulo. Hi teacher. Hello Karen, how are you? Lisa, I'm fine. No, not yet. Ah, okay. That's uh, fine. Okay. Ya que este módulo lo terminaríamos el lunes 21. Okay, people. Let's get it started tonight. We're the with the first attendance. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, who listening to music? Okay, I'm looking for something. Sorry. Here. Okay. Okay, let's start with Ana Lilian Reyes. Present. Welcome. Brenda Beatriz Calderón. Mm -hmm, not yet. Brian Javier Carmona. Not yet. David Orlando Álvarez. No more. Gabriela Irene Menjibar. Not yet. Uy, varios están tarde. Guillermo Antonio García. Javier Aldair Escobar. Here, teacher. Welcome, Javier. José Arnoldo Mazariego. Present, teacher. Good. 
Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present teacher. Welcome back. It's good if you can turn on the cameras for the attendance at least. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay. Teacher, I'm here. Who? Oh, Brenda. Okay. Brenda Beatriz Calderon. Karen Vanessa Moratasha. Present. Okay. You have internet now? At home? Yes. Excellent. <laughs> Laura, Carolina. Not yet. Oh, that's strange. She's always on time. Maria Concepcion Jovel. Still taking a shower. Uh, Maria Ivania Palma. Present. Thank you for being on time. Marisol Betsania. Present teacher. Thank you. Present teacher, Gabriela. Uh -huh. <laughs> Present teacher, Brian. A little late. Okay. Vamos a... Brian also. Okay. Present teacher, okay. present. Good. Ma Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. Welcome. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present teacher. Welcome. Zaira Marleni Larin. Present. Excellent. Wendy Maribel Zavaleta. Present. Good. Jenny Suleima Santos. Jenny, no. Elias Ael Matute. I hear. Okay, very good. Okay, welcome to the last week of beginners or module three. Thank you for being on time. I know it's difficult, but it's not impossible. Okay. Very good. Well, tonight we are going to start section three um, in our manual or in our book. So let me start sharing the screen. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Do, 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 here. Take this out, this no, this no too many things here okay tonight's objective is let me ask let me ask to uh, who is with the camera off let me check who is with the camera off Okay, so Myra. Myra, are you there? Ya voy, teacher. Estamos llegando a la casa. Todavía no he terminado de llegar. Marisol, are you there? I hear teacher. Um Solo termino de cenar. Falta la pexi. Ay, 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 ya le dije, no coman pescado en día de clase, de cangre. Ah. Ok, gracias. Ok. ¿Cómo se llama? Se llama el rey de la, el dios de la destrucción, se llama Viera oh. Hensivo, ¿está? 
Ok, thank you very much. Sí, qué bueno. we, Gracias. We Gracias we, por la información, Mauricio. We don't need that information right now, Mauricio. Excuse turn, me. Turn up your... No, turn it off. Ok. Eso. Teacher. Uh, yes. Es solo una cuestión. Una pre... Bueno, algo que pasó el viernes, no sé. ¿Qué o pasó? Sábado. Eh, Wendy dijo que quería aclarar algo, no sé, con, con los compañeros. Ah, no, quería... solamente de que el, de que me, de que como habían escrito y yo no me había fijado que era el teacher, yo pensaba que ustedes, que pensaba que eran tareas cuando ustedes escriben. Eso es lo que me pasa. Pero ahí, ahí Pero dice Saúl que... nada más. Uh -huh. Ahí dice Saúl en el teacher, ya sabemos ya que solo él es. Uh -huh. um... Eso era. No. Ay, no. que no Javeli. <risa> oh, pero igual el foro es para, para anotar ahí. Para, si para que, ay, en eso tengo que fijarme yo en el, los nombres que aparecen ahí. Gracias. No, no. Pero es, es, es válido, es válido. Solo esa era la, la preocupación, porque sí, la, como, como grupo, el sábado sí nos, nos preocupó ahí en el trabajo. ¿Qué, qué estaba pasando? Ah. No, nada, nada, tranquilo, tranquilo. No, no, no le van a ir a hacer ahí manifestación a Wendy. ¿La tenemos cerca? ¿La ya, tenemos? Ya, ya. Te tienen bien cerca, es cierto. Ah, Son vecinos. A la Dicho, vuelta de la esquina, ¿sabes? Ya Elía anda juntando llantas. Cabal. Dicho, ah, ya difícil. veo, ya veo, peligroso. Dicho. Hola. Ya la llamo, donde está el, cel, el tele a todo volumen, es el chucho <risa> ladrando. <risa> no hay donde perderse. ¿no? no, ya la llamo. Y que se pierde con las tareas. Qué envidia me da Brenda. Yo sí quisiera tomar yo de agua, pero no logro ni acabarme la mitad de este vasito. <risa> me regañan enseguida. Toma más agua. Sí, les digo, tomo, pero con fresquito, con fruta ahí, con cafecito. Ahí ve el agua. Ok. Bueno, bueno, ¿qué? ¿para qué estábamos haciendo correr a Mayra? Que ahí está, mire, todavía comiendo. Eh... No se me ha planchado, estaba, te he que le creo. <risa> A Pueblo le ha quedado bien. Está bueno. Bye. Mayra, please read the objective for tonight's class. It is here, okay? I just want you to read this, the objective. I will be able to, Mayra. Mayra. Está con el bocado en la boca, teacher. Estaba terminando otra vez. Es más que Melcocha está comiendo. Los dientes pegados. Ok. Va, le leo ahí donde dice I will be. Yes, please. Unit 4. I will be able to request information about travel service and accommodation related to business trip. Ok, very good, very good. Uh, vamos a pedir uno más que lea. Vamos a ver quién tenemos con cámara apagada. Karen me acaba de apagar. Bien la tenía. Karen, read please the objective for tonight. No veo, pero... Okay, let me share the screen. Here it is. Ah, pues. Todavía no veo. ¿Qué leo? Tonight's objective, this part. I will be able to request information about travel service and accommodations related to a business trip. Okay, very good. Thank you very much. Okay, so information about travel services. We are going to talk about travel services and accommodations accommodations 
but not only, not just for vacation, but for a business trip. Okay. So we are going to, to be talking about travel services and accommodations for a business trip. So we have two experts in this class. We have Wendy, which, who is expert in travel services, and Syra, who is expert in hotel accommodations and amenities. So they are not going to have any problem tonight. Okay. There are four, three questions or two, two questions to start. First question says, do you usually go on business trips? Um, yes or no? Raise your hand if you usually go on business trips. Um, no, solo en el bus que va para el trabajo. I never. <laughs> never, Mauricio. Never. No, ya I vamos never. A, ya vamos a pedir que lo manden a hacer algo. Uh, Arnoldo says yes. Ay, tenemos quienes eran los que no podían, no encontrar una manita. Wendy, ¿encontró la manita, Wendy? No. <risa> es que me, Ay, sí me salió una vez, pero después ya no. <risa> Arnoldo, eh, ¿qué más dices? Ya, yeah, solo Arnoldo. Mauricio uh, y Eli también. Mauricio dice que nunca, dice que no esté inventando, dice que él nunca lo han mandado. Ah, Jonathan, ok, Jonathan. Yeah, nobody else. Me, only, only a year. Ah, ok. Good. So, business trips. And the other question is similar or, or is related, está relacionada. It is, uh, oh, share. What are three hotel services you often use? What are three hotel services you often use? Well, let me ask another question. Who has been or stayed in a hotel. ¿Quién ya ha estado o se ha quedado en un hotel con H? Hotel. Yes. Ah, raise your yes. hand. Ah, ok. Wendy, Javier, Jonathan. Ah, ¿Qué más? Brian. Yeah, hago la aclaración porque aquí en El Salvador is a big difference between hotel and motel. <laughs> But that is just here in El Salvador. Other ah, pues countries... Aquí, okay, espere, voy a quitar la mano. Tío, espere, voy a quitar no, la mano, no, pues. no, tampoco estamos hablando de... <laughs> no, mejor no digo nada. Ah... <laughs> uh, Uh, in, in other countries, uh -huh. it's normal. Yes, a motel. A motel. It's, well, it's very small. It's small. Yeah, it's a smaller than a hotel and it's just um, a, a similar service. Okay. Hostales. Hostel. Hostales. Uh -huh. Yeah. Hostels or guest houses. So, but muy pocos han, se han quedado alguna vez en un, en un hotel. Um, ok, pero podemos imaginarnos la situación. O algún día nos tocará. And so, what are three common services people use in a hotel? A ver, vamos a preguntar a Zaira, que es así la experta. What are Zaira three common services or the three most common services people use in a hotel? Syrah? Yes. 
You turn off this microphone, Siren. Yo puliéndome aquí. Sí, oh, y ahí ya estaba con todo. Service of breakfast. Breakfast, ok. Eh, hotel, hotel service. Um, de, ¿cómo dice? De, meeting room. Ah, oh, ok. Eh, a veces también lo usan los, los, los huéspedes. El salón porque que van por, por trabajo y también hacemos ese servicio, prestamos a los huéspedes eh, de qué más uh, lavandería, no sé cómo se dice. Okay. Ah, bueno, aquí está. Laundry. Ok. Laundry. Ok. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very good. Thank you. Ok. Thank you, Zaira. So, common hotel services. Huh? Well, we have a conversation here. Let's take a look to this conversation. Let's practice the conversation. And later we are going to continue with some questions about the conversation, okay? Make sure the screen again to practice the conversation together. Okay, first I'm going to read the conversation. Please pay attention to the pronunciation, to the intonation, and listen carefully, okay? Escuchen con cuidado. It's a conversation between, between the hotel agent and Rosa. Uh, well, actually it's a travel agent. No, because the phone call is to a travel agency. It is a phone call to a travel agency. We have the agent and Rosa. Okay, listen. Mark's travel agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking room, please. Uh, or non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, let me read it again. So, listen, just listen. Pay attention to the pronunciation and intonation. Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay. Now listen and repeat after me, please. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Mark's Travel Agency. Can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Good morning. Good morning. I need a reservation I for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? 
Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay, I'm going to stay three days. I go Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Are you, Are you going, going to need, need the service? service? Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, yes, please. Okay. Now, I am the agent and you are Rosa, okay? Okay. Okay. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. Of I am Rosa Puentes. I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Thank you. Where are you going to stay? Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? No smoking, smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes. Yes, please. 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 Okay, very good. Now let's switch. You are the agent and I am Rosa. So you begin. One, two, three. Mark, 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 can I help you? Can I help you? you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. sure. May, May I, I have your, your name, name, please? May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. <laughs> Are you, are you going, going to stay, stay in a smoking room? Non-smoking, non 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 please. Are you going, are you going, going to stay in a smoking room? Yes, please. Okay, very good. Now, uh, any question with the conversation? What is the meaning of showroom? Shuttle. Shuttle, sir. Yes. Shuttle service is a private transportation that usually goes from the hotel to the airport. Okay. Yes, but it's, it's like a bus that has uh, different mm, yes. hours. Mm -hmm. So that is the shuttle service. It's, it's like a tra transportation from the hotel, then it has a particular route, tiene una ruta ya determinada. Uh, usually is to the airports. Yeah. That is the shuttle service. So, un, un Un, un transporte ya con cierto destino. Ok. Any other question? No. Good. Ok. So I'm going to send you to work in pairs. Okay. In order that you practice the conversation with your partner. Ok. Practice the conversation two, three, four times. And then I want you to respond this exercise, complete this exercise. There are four sentences or four statements. And you have to decide according to the conversation, 
if they are true or false. Okay, you can discuss in pairs to find out para encontrar si son true or false. Yeah. Y quisiera que agreguen dos más. ¿Verdad? En grupo, ahí en pareja, que agreguen dos más para definir después si son verdadero o falso. ¿Es is, is that clear? Clear. Okay, thank you very much. Let's go in pairs. Okay. Very good. Okay, he's ready. So first, you're going to practice the conversation. And second, you're going to check true or false. And number three, you are going to add, van a agregar, two more statements. Dos declaraciones más para de definir si son true or false. Todo de acuerdo a la conversation. Okay, go and work with your partner, please.
Hmm, quiero ver. Fíjese que quizás yo voy a hacer una que diga más o menos como en español, ¿va? y ahí la voy a ordenar en inglés. Una que diga, Rosa va a viajar hacia, y le voy a cambiar otro lugar, como aquí pone Costa Rica, ¿va? y la fecha. Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Woohoo! Hey, cambiamos ahora. Yes, Mars Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 4th. Hello. Lo repetimos. Sí. Bye. Yo con Okay. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Fuentes. Thank you, Miss Fuentes. <coughs> Need a reservation for us. Uh, good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mrs. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Yes. Yes. Mm. Volvemos a practicar. Yes. Yes, entonces. En yo agent. Yes. Uh, Mark's travel agency. How would you, how can I help you? Good morning. Está ahí. Uy, Rosa. Rosa is going to travel. Reservation. O res, reservación, como es en going to. Rosa va a reservar por tres días. Entonces puedo poner por cuatro días para que sea falso. ¿Verdad? <risa> ah, no, verdadero. Entonces, pero que ya está going to stay por tres días. Ya es verdadero. Y Rosa going to travel Costa Rica. Estamos poniendo ese los dos. Le estamos poniendo ese los dos porque sí. dice Are you going to need a shuttle service? Shuttle service. 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 Porque si le service. ponemos no service, service es service. ya. Ajá. Dice solo servicio, service. no dice no servicios. Service. Ajá. Service. No services. Ajá, cabal, cabal. Ahí donde dice solo service. Yes, please. Va, voy a empezar yo como la agencia, dale. Ok. Mark, travel agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation. Are you going to stay in, in a smoke or, or non smoke rooms? Smoking rooms? Non smoking, please. Are you going to need a uh, chauffeur service? Shuttle service. Yo creo que se dice shuttle, shuttle service. Short service, shortly. Shortly, shortly, algo así va. Shortly, shortly service. Teacher. Yes, please. Teacher. Claro. Excuse me, uh, how do you say 
Shaltre or Shultre? Shuttle. Shuttle. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Okay. Si quiere, vuelvo a comenzar otra vez por esa palabra. Muy bien. Continue. Exciting. Hello, what happened? Hello. You finished. Ya me salí, nos salimos, teacher. <laughs> Pero aquí estamos ya. Okay. Solo era, teacher, las cuatro preguntas y dos oraciones, ¿verdad? Yes. De igual, va Para falso y verdadero. Jenny, you're the lucky one that have the personalized class tonight. What? <laughs> I do not understand, teacher. Yes, you are the lucky... Lucky, how to say yeah, lucky? Lucky. Good, good luck. You have ah. the good luck today. You are the lucky Thank you, teacher. <laughs> for the 10 minutes class at the end. Ah, sí, siempre me pasa. Ah. Ya vengo tarde del trabajo, tipo. Siempre vengo corriendo. Yeah, okay, okay, no problem. Pero me conecto, siempre me conecto. Yes, but I'm telling you that you are a, this, a, how can I say? You are the one for the 10 minutes at the end of the class. Today, one. 10 minutes. One. 10 minutos. Yeah, you are the... First, you have the personal session today. Diez minutos, per mí. No. <laughs> no. You have the personal Ay, session minutos. today. Okay. Yes. Okay. So, if you have any question, think about it, okay? Okay. Okay. And you are relative to the former mayor. Uh, former mayor? Yes. Mr. Who is in Spanish? The mayor. Mayor? The mayor. You know, the mayor is the, how can I use, um, is the It's like the president of a city. Major. Major. Mm. For example, the major in San Salvador yeah, yeah. is Mario Duran. Es como decir el mayor. No, no. 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 The major, major. The major in... San Miguel is Will Salgado. El alcalde. Yeah, the mayor. So, y solo, is... esa solo esa, ese sinónimo significado tiene, o sea, the no. mayor, no hay como... No. Oh. No. Okay. But that is the name of the, the person in charge of a city. The okay. mayor. So my okay. question is, if you, Jenny, are relative to the former, el ex, the ex-major of Hayake? Mm, no. No? No. Ah. Luna. Because, no, no, no. The el former, llamaba... the ex. Ajá, el, el anterior. Yes. Se llamó, era el apellido Luna. En Hayake, it wasn't Mr. Sí. Santos? Sí, Santos Luna. Ah, ok. But Santos is, here, is the name. El nombre, sí, el nombre. Ah, and your is last name. 
Sí, ya tenía bastante tiempo ese señor. Yes. Sí. ¿Usted lo conocía, Ticho? Well, my wife. No. Because my wife worked in the school. Ah, what is the name of this? Um, it's a school that is not exactly in Hayake, but Curacao. Curacao. Uh -huh. My wife was the worked in that school. Is uh -huh. yeah. a teacher. Yeah, she is a teacher. Mm -hmm. She worked in that school uh, like two or three years ago. Mm -hmm. Is this San Salvador? Uh, no, from Lourdes. Uh, we, live, we live in Lourdes. Here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's not that far. But I have the ex husband of my aunt lives in Hayake. Oh, I, and, I do live in the in the, the uh, city, Hayaco. Yes. I, I don't. No. I, no. En los alrededores, ¿cómo se dice? In a... Uh, uh, could be the suburbs. Mm -hmm. yeah, the suburb. Know. Oh. Yes. It's, it's near. Oh. By, no, 10 minutes. Ah. Mm -hmm. Where? La Flores? No. No. Se llama La Labor. La Entonces, Labor. Ah. Casi Salnique. Eh, ah. Sí. After Hayake. Yes. Ah. Yo no, yo sí antes, pero sí esta carretera ya. Ah. Ajá. Es más arriba. ¿O no? No, no, antes de llegar. Antes de, antes, antes de Curazado todavía. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, okay. Por eso conozco ahí. <laughs> Hello, people. Welcome back. Now, two volunteers to practice the conversation. Me. Eli. And who is your partner, Eli? Me. Me. And Jonathan. Know. Okay. Okay. Eli and Jonathan. Who starts? Eli starts. Eli is the agent okay. and Jonathan is Rosa. Okay. But let's do something. You can use your real names. Okay? Okay. You don't have to be Rosa, Jonathan. You can use your real name. Okay. Okay? Okay, Eli, you begin. Lights, camera, action. Max Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Jonathan Vigil. Thank you, Miss Vigil. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay two days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or not a smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need a shower service? Yes, please. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, thank you. Only one, one situation. Pay attention to that, Ali. It's not Miss Vigil. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you. Two more. Two more volunteers. One, two. La Brenda está levantando la mano, teacher. No la vea. Okay, Ivania. Ivania is volunteer. And Lilian. And Lilian. Okay, very good. Thank you. So remember, you can use use no no can use your names okay you are not rosa puentes use your real names okay so ivania is the agent 
And Lillian is the, the customer, the client. Okay? So, Ivania, you start. Lights, camera, action. Lillian, down. Lil, the travel angel, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I help? May I, may I have your name, please? Oh, of course, I am Lillian Reyes. Thank you, Mr. Lillian. Mr. Reyes, how long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three, three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or no smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need the shower service? Yes, please. Okay, thank you very much. Ivania, just remember, okay, it's Miss. Miss. She is Miss. Yeah, because it's a woman, it's a lady. Let me share the screen just to re remind you something. Okay. So, in English, we have different titles for women. For example, one is Miss, the other is Miss and Mrs. Okay. Miss is for a single woman. Mrs. Miss is for a married or single woman. And Mrs. is for a married woman okay okay so there are three different titles for a woman these are called titles let me use capital here titles and for men we are simple, we are not complicated. Woman, women are complicated, men are simple. For men is only mister, and that's all. Mister. mister is for married or single man. Ya veo que no nos complicamos nosotros los hombres. But... No, men are simple. Teacher, yes. Eh, pronunciation en el caso de, de Miss eh, en las tres, digamos, porque yes, suena igual o, o yes, no. Yes, very similar. Ah, okay. Miss, Miss, Mrs. Mister, Miss. Mrs. <laughs> Mrs. Yeah, Miss. Okay. Miss. 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 Mrs. 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 Okay. Yeah, this is <laughs> yeah miss is to not offend yeah you see we have to be careful to not <laughs> offend a woman because like can I cannot let go it's a, okay is I am not sure is a single woman and I am not sure is a married woman and I don't want to offend that woman 
I better use men are intelligent. Mm -hmm. And you say, no, miss. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank so, you. Teacher. And for men, only one, Mr. Okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. Single, okay. yeah. married, divorced, widow, <laughs> Mr. <sea>. Mr. <laughs> Y si, y entonces no va, teacher. Uh, uh, <laughs> sir, is, 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 sir, no está relacionado con, es, con, con, el, con, con el, el estado civil. Ah, pero, ok. Pero igual, o sea, mm -hmm. sir is for, sir is for married or, or single. Mom, teacher, excuse me. For married yeah. or single. Yep. Eh, cuando se dice eh, soltero, excuse me. Ya. Yeah. Eh, para decir soltero, no existe, solo mister. Para decir soltero, ¿de qué? <risa> de que no, ya exacto. quedó sin esposa. <risa> no, soltero, quiero decir. <risa> Solter <risa> solterón. <risa> Lo dejó el tren. <risa> Mister. <risa> Mister Todo es Mister, hombre. Quedó para Sugar Daddy. <risa> ok, vaya, entonces, okay. ¿any Thanks. question? No, Let solo me. que señorita le dije a Jonathan yo. <risa> <risa> ok, yeah. let's continue now with una, una. Uh, no, yo no quiero eso. One more, un, una pareja más para. Para Pato, la le está levantando la mano Brenda, teacher. Ah. <risa> okay. Me, okay, me, okay, sí, okay, when? Quiere Guillermo. <risa> Wendy. No sé si querrá. ¿En Guillermo? No sé si querrá. <risa> hola, hola. <risa> Vaya. Okay. okay, so Wendy, you are the agent, and Guillermo, you are the client. Okay. Espérame un ratito, solo busco. Okay, okay. Ready? Okay, Ready. Wendy, you begin. One, two, three. No, no tengo la. Sorry. So. Okay, let me share the screen for you. Thank you. Okay. Me cerró. So, lights, camera, action. <laughs> Mark's travel agency, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel uh, to Costa Rica on April. Uh, oh. 14. 14. 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Guillermo Garcia. Thanks, Mr. Garcia. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Not smoking, please. Are you going to need the shovel service? Yes, please. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. So everybody, please, be careful with the pronunciation of this word. Y todas alguna parecida. Okay, so especially this uh, part. Reservation. Be careful because hacemos un sonido muy fuerte. Reservation. No es cha. No es, un, no es una che. ¿Verdad? No, que no se nos oiga así, que no se oiga un reservation. ¿Verdad? Es, es mucho más suave, sí. Reservation. 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 Yes. Reservation. 
Yes, yes. Sí. En otras, otras palabras. Conversation. Education. Transportation. ¿Ya? Que no se oiga esa ch. Así, ¿verdad? Si no, es un sonido un poco más, más suave, ¿ok? I need a reservation. Ok, very good. Y esta, que veo que les ha dado dolor de cabeza. Shuttle. 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 Ok. Shuttle. Yes, yeah, siempre un sonido suave. Shuttle. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Ok. Es sha, sha. Shuttle service. Okay, now let's see the true or false. Number one, Rosa needs a double room. False. 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 false? Yes. Oh, false. Why? Why? Rosa needs single room. Uh, single room. Ah, okay. She needs a single room. Correct. Rosa is going to stay for three days. True. 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 Correct. True. Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room. False. 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 Rosa wow. is going to stay in a non-smoking room. Correct. Mm -hmm. no, and number four, Rosa is going to rent a car at the airport. False. False. Oh, wow. This question, not the paragraph. Hmm? No. Yes. Uh, she, need, she need a shuttle service. Shuttle ah, service. she needs the shuttle she service. The shuttle service. Okay. Yes, that's the that's the reason. Excellent. Now I like to hear some of your statements. A ver, lo, algo otra oración que hicieron ustedes. Let me start with. Um, okay. Who said me? Okay. Mauricio. Okay, Mauricio. Rosa is, Rosa is going to travel to Mexico. Okay, people, is that true or false? False. 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 Okay, good. One more, volunteers. Rosa traveled to Costa Rica on April 15th. Uh -huh. It's true. True, it's true, it's, Karen? It's false. It's, it's false. 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 It's false. It's from April. It is April 14. April 14. Ah. Not 15. I don't you really care. Day. I don't listen to it. Ah, pay attention. Pay attention. <laughs> okay. <trampa>. Yes. <laughs> Remember. Malia sos. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Me, teacher. Okay, Ivania. Rosa needs reservation for a vacation. Ah, uh huh. Mm, True or false? Information. False. False. No specific. False. False. Well. Yes. No information. No information, actually. No information, yes. No information. Yes. No information. Uh, for or not yeah. vacation. It's not vacation. No. Oh, okay. What says? Um, uh, no, no, porque es business trip. Business trip. Business trip. I'm going to say. That's Brenda it. dijo una ahí, no le he escuchado. Porque así dice la lección, pero la conversación no dice nada. No dice información. <laughs> pero está bien, ok. One more. A ver, vamos, vamos. Alguien que tenga algo diferente. Ajá, Zaira. Rosa requested buffet service. Oh, ajá, uh -huh, people. 
False. False. Okay. Yeah, we don't have that information. Good, but it's false. And another one. Me teacher. Okay, Lillian. Rosa works in the travel uh, agency. Okay, good. False. 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 Yes, okay. False. More. Another one. The agent's name is Juan. Ah. Uh huh. It's false. False. Why? Not information. Not information. Teacher. Not information. Uh huh. Brenda, prendió el 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 micrófono tres veces y no le dio chance, teacher. Qué va. Ah, okay, okay. Él y tuvo que haber sido abogado. <laughs> no listen. No listen. No, sin, sindicalista. Sí. Se sí. pelea por los derechos de los compañeros. Va a pelear conmigo. Pero porque me ve humilde. No, teacher, es que, es que Brenda la tengo en la pantalla con usted y Javier Aldair. Entonces, como Spotless. solo somos los cuatro. Solo veo que Brenda puchaba, puchaba el micrófono para hablar y usted no daba chance. Ok, very good. Now, uh, I need to take the second attendance, people. Let's go quickly, please. Uh, turn on your cameras. Ana Lilian. Present. Reyes. Brenda Beatriz Calderón. Present. Brian Javier Carmona. David Orlando Álvarez, no more. Gabriela Irene Menjibar. Present. Guillermo Antonio García. Present. Javier Aldair Escobar. Here, teacher. José Arnoldo Mazariego. Present, teacher. Ok. José Jonathan Vigil. Present. José Rodrigo Hernández. Present. Karen Vanessa Moratalla. Present. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present, teacher. María Concepción Cerón. Present. María Ivania Palma. Present. Marisol Betsania Pacheco. Present. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present, teacher. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present. Ba uh, Zaira Marlene Larín. Present. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present. Jenny Suleima Santos. Present. And Elias Ael Matute. Present. Okay, very good. Well, let's continue with the next activity. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Oh, well, let's take a look to this vocabulary. Accommodation and amenities. Accommodation and amenities. You see again that pronunciation, accommodation. Yeah, don't say accommodation. No, accommodation. Okay. Accommodation. Yes. Uh, let me ask to uh, Ivania, can you read the meaning of accommodation, please? Ivania? Uh, yeah. um, ah, yes. A place ensure us room in a hotel where travel can sleep and find other service. Okay, very good. A place such as a room in a hotel where travelers can sleep and find other services. That's accommodation. There are different types 
of accommodation. Single room, double room, uh, suite, um, smoking room, non-smoking room. So those are accommodations. Mm -hmm. And the other is amenities. Let me ask to um, Brian. Brian, can you please read the meaning of amenities? Exito. The factors of the hotel that all at the lab for guests to use a, a gin, a pole, a minibar, a jacuzzi, A to C. Okay. So the features or characteristics of the hotel that are available, that están disponibles for guests to use. Those are amenities. Gym, pool, mini bar, jacuzzi, uh, restaurant, bar. Okay, so those are amenities. Different characteristic or features that are available for guests to use. That is the difference between accommodations, accommodations and amenities. Accommodations and amenities. Okay. <sighs> Now we have some hotel services and amenities in this vocabulary. All right, so that I want you to, let's write here, according to the pictures, please. Complete the exercise and then we are going to check it together. Yes. Mando a grupo. No. No, ah, sorry. No. Es que me desconecté y ahorita se me conectó otra vez. Ah, ok. No. Va a hacer el ejercicio de la página. Yes. Yes. Thanks. Ok, let's see. What is number one? Wait up call. Wake up call. Up call. Wake up call. Okay, that's right. Wake up call. Number one. What is number two? Loud service. Loud service. service. Loud service. Service. Laundry service. Laundry. Laundry service. Laundry service. Laundry service. Number two. Okay. What is number three? Fresh in the room. Fresh in the room. Fresh in the room. In the room. Fridge in the room. Fridge. Yeah, fridge is for refrigerator, okay? Short. Fridge in the room. Number four. 
Business center. Business center. Business center. Business center. Yeah, you can hear center or center. Business center or business center. Okay. What is number five? Safe. 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 Mm -hmm. Perfect. What is number six? Single, Single room. room. Okay. Single room. What is number seven? Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. And what is number eight? Wi-Fi Wi internet. Wi-Fi internet. Wi -fi. Mm -hmm. internet. Okay, very good. Let's practice the pronunciation of this vocabulary. Wake up call. Repeat. Wake up call. Wake up call. Okay, laundry service. Laundry service. Yeah, laundry, laundry, laundry service. Laundry. 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 laundry laundry service. Fridge in the room. Fridge, fridge in the room. Fridge in the room. Fridge in the room. Business center. Business center. Business center. Business center. Business center. Safe. 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 Single room. Single room. Single room. Single room. Single room. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Shuttle service. Wi-Fi internet. Wi-Fi internet. Wi-Fi internet. Wi-Fi internet. Any Wi-Fi cutting? Any question? No. Question. No. No. Good. It's perfect. It's clear. Safe en sí es caja fuerte o cómo? Yes. Así. Yes. Okay. okay. Now let me give you an, another. Okay. Okay, I have um, more vocabulary about hotel, okay? Uh, if you can see, I have many words here. Uh, let me read them for you. I don't know if you can see the vocabulary here. Uh, let me enhance this a little bit. Okay. So I have pictures and this vocabulary as well. Reception, receptionist, maid, bellboy, key, luggage, tip, safe, air conditioner, 
towels, double bed, single bed, lift, swimming pool, spa center, buffet, hot tub, lobby, gym, and sauna. Okay, and the pictures, okay? So I'm going to share the presentation to you. And I want you to move the words to the correct place, okay? For example, number one. Number one is we use the word lift. Es una manera de decirlo. ¿Verdad? Otra es elevator. Pero elevator. una común es lift. Ok. The, el ascensor es a lift. Entonces así pueden arrastrar las palabras. Ok. Yo les voy a compartir ahí en, en WhatsApp la presentación. Esta presentación. Ustedes la pueden abrir en su cell phone o en in your uh, computer y colocar las palabras en el lugar correcto. Ok. Y uh, lo voy a poner en, en las parejas para que lo hagan juntos. Oh, let me share the presentation in WhatsApp first. This PowerPoint. Ta -ta. Give me a moment. Here. Ok, ahí está ya. Now go and work in pairs. Ok, lo abren y pueden colocar ahí las palabras. Pueden moverlas. O si no, si no lo pueden hacer así, solo lo pueden ver. Pues pueden hacer la lista, ¿no? Número uno es tal, número dos es tal etcétera. Oh, tengo aquí algunos. Sin grupo, ya los voy a mandar a un grupo. Mm. ¿Cómo? Ve. Ustedes dos estaban juntos, ¿verdad, Javier y Jenny? ¿Sí? Yeah. Yes. Sí. Ay, qué mandea. Bueno. Ah. Bueno, después lo muevo. Entonces al 5. Todo dos. Ah. 
Rodrigo, Ivania lo está esperando. Rodrigo, Ivania is waiting for you. Salió. Plum, plum, plum. Ve. Hello, teacher. Me dejó afuera. ¿Qué pasó? Me dejó afuera. Yo solito estaba. Bueno, entonces, a ver con quién te mando. Menos con la madre, teacher.
No sé. Eh, si gusta el 7, que es sauna, ¿verdad? Yes. Y el 8, le podemos poner ese el el doble P. No, ese como no. no, el lobby es el 19, ¿verdad? 8. 15 y la 8. La 15. Y la de las 15. opciones nos va a quedar uno. Eh, veamos. K. Perception. K. 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 9. Uy, no, se le movió el cosito. W aquí, vea. Sí. Sí, esta me dio vuelta. Ah, no. Esta. Uh. Sobra esa de Entonces las, las 20, las 20 ya están, va. Sí, ya. Ah, ok. Ya está. ¿Alguna duda con alguna palabra? Bueno, acá. Teacher. Este, teacher, no sé si me escucha. Yes. Teacher, can you hear me? Ok. Este, yo me podía lugar como bagage. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál sería la diferencia? No, no, sinónimos. No es sinónimos. Es lo mismo. Y teníamos dudas con la... La resección. No, con la 5 y con la 7. Uh -huh. Que no sabíamos si la 5 era hot tub o sauna. Mm. Michelle. Es que otra es como jacuzzi, Batiche. Five. Yeah, but it's hot tub. Uh -huh. Y el sauna es la 7 porque está el vaporcito ahí. Yes. Uh -huh. Y en la... En la 5 está el rich. Rich. Uh -huh. En la 10 y la 19. Yo les decía que receptionist es la 10 porque está como enfocando ahí el cristiano hablando por teléfono. Y recepción es la 19. Es el lugar. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Very good. Okay. Thank you, teacher. See you. Yeah. See you, teacher. Llevo, ¿qué tal? Cuando entré. Ah. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Siento que vamos bien, teacher. Finish. Pero... Ah, ya terminamos, pero no sé, tenemos un par de dudas, no sé. Sobre la number six, team. Tip. No sé, no sé si está correcto. Es como propina, creo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, correct. Ah, una lobby, ya, recepcionista. Ya, yeah, es fine. La número 5 pensábamos que era como jacuzzi o algo así, pero es hot. Bien raro ese nombre, Tisha. Hot top. Hot top. Bañera. Jamás supe que era como bañera de hidromasaje. En serio. Ok, very good. See you. Thank you, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello. Are you finish? Finish. No, not yet. Not yet? Not yet. <laughs> 
Sí, ya terminamos. Soy la licenciada, sí, ya las escribió, yo no las escribiendo las estoy. <risa> Okay. <clears throat> See you. Well, I'm gonna stop now. Okay. See you later. Okay, okay, welcome back. We're going to check together. Let me share the screen. Okay. Here. Okay, so number one, we said it's lift. Number two, What is number two, swimming people? Pool. Swimming pool. Swimming pool. Swimming pool. Yeah, swimming pool. Number three. Buffet. Buffet. Number four. Spa center. Spa center. Spa center. Spa center. Number five. Hot tub. Hot tub. Yeah, tub. Ay, como se va a decir hot dog. <laughs> Number six. <laughs> yes. Number seven. Sauna. Uh, sauna. 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 Number eight. Love it. Lobby. 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 Number nine. Single bed. Single bed. Single bed. No, no. Not. <laughs> Single bed. <laughs> Number ten. Jingle bell. Receptionist. Ah, receptionist. Yes. Receptionist. Eleven. Jing. Jim. 12. Air conditioner. Air conditioner. Air conditioner. No, 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 no. Air conditioner. Okay. 13. Bellboy. 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 14. Toes. Toes. Towel. 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 Fifteen. Key. 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 Sixteen. Luggage. 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 Key. 
Luggage. Double bed. Double bed. Double bed. Eighteen. Made. Made. Nineteen. Reception. 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 Twenty. Safe. 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 Okay. Very good. Safe. Let's practice quickly. Repeat after me. Lift. Lift. Yeah, lift. lift. Swimming pool. Swimming pool. Buffet. Buffet. Spa center. Spa center. Hot tub. Hot tub. Hot tub. Tip. 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 Sauna. 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 Lobby. Lobby. Single bed. Single, Single bed. bed. Receptionist. 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 Gym. 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 Air conditioner. Air, Air conditioner. conditioner. Bellboy. Bellboy. Bell Bell Towels. Towels. Key. 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 Luggage. Luggage. Double bed. Double bed. Maid. Maid. Reception. 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 Safe. 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 Okay, people. Mera salsa encurtidos, vamos. Now you have big bad vocabulary. <laughs> so next time you visit a hotel, you know this vocabulary. Okay, let's take this the last attendance for today. And we start with Anna Lilian Reyes. Present. Good night, Anna Lilian. Brenda Beatriz Calderon. Present. Have a good night. Brian Javier Carmona. Present. Good night. David Orlando Alvarez, no more. Gabriela Irene Menjibar. Present, teacher. Good night. Guillermo Antonio Garcia. Present. Good night. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present, teacher. Good night. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Present good night. Good night. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Good night. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Present. Good night. Good night. Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Good night. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Good night. Maria Concepción Cerón. Present. Good night. Marisol Betsania Pacheco. Present. Good night, Maria Ivania Palma. Present. Good night, Mauricio Antonio mm -hmm. Rivera. Present, good night. Teacher. Good night, Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present. Good night, Zaira Marlene Larín. Present. Good night, Wendy Maribel good Zabaleta. Night, Present. Good night, Jenny Suleyma Santos. Present. Ah, 10 more minutes. Yes. And Elias Ael Matute. Present. Good night. Good night, Bye. people. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye, Remember, Sulema. Finish Bye. the night. platform. Bye. Good Bye, night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Okay, Jenny. Bye, teacher. How can I help you? ¿Qué le gustaría que reforcemos? Quizá la diferencia entre should, who y cuál es el otro? Would. Would. Sí, las okay. dos tres. Ok, vamos a ver entonces. Let me share the screen. Look for the book. Good, okay. Acá um, vamos a hablar acerca del uso acá, ¿verdad? Porque no, este, es, este no sería el único uso que se le da a estos términos. Good 
and would. Ok, so hay otros. Pero acá los hemos usado como la forma de solicitar algo. De una manera polite, ok, de una manera educada, así de, de buenos, de buenos modales. Yeah. Practically, there is no big difference between this question. No hay mayor diferencia en, en el sentido en cuanto a, a estas dos preguntas, ¿verdad? Simplemente son dos formas diferentes de preguntar lo mismo. Uh -huh. Ok, ¿cómo es esto aquí? Es? Cuando decimos could you, eso es una manera de pedir algo, ¿no? Un favor. Could you print out the budget file? So, y otra manera, o sea, yo bien podría decirlo usando would you mind, que eh, sería would you mind. Solo que el verbo va diferente cuando uso would you mind. Sí. ¿No? El verbo tiene que ir en ing. Would you mind printing out the budget file? ¿Verdad? Pero sí puedo hacer la pregunta usando would you mind. Aquí. La misma pregunta en otra forma. Y no tiene, o sea, ninguna diferencia. O, o sea, en algunos casos se usa una, en otras otras tampoco. No. Igual. Igual. No, no. Dos maneras de preguntar algo, de solicitar algo de manera polite. Es como, en traducción es como podrías. Podría. La primera sí, could you. Uh -huh. No, no. Podría. ¿Y you, would you mind es te importaría? Te importaría. Ajá. Entonces, igual, would you mind opening the window? Yo pudiera decir, could you uh, open. open the window? The window. Yeah. Y yo. No. Ok. Aquí. Pero algunas personas todavía lo pueden dar. Todavía un toque más de refinación. Si le agrega el please. Uh -huh. Que pudiera ser aquí. Could you open the window please. O también puede ir aquí. ¿verdad? Could you please. Open the window. En cambio, por ejemplo, acá, si, si yo quiero agregar please con would you mind, creo que, déjame ver, would you mind printing out the budget file, please. Aquí lo único donde podría ir es al final. Uh -huh. Con would you mind. Would you mind printing out the budget file, please. Ahí puedo ponerlo, y en medio no. No sé si había escuchado, no sé, que alguno era como un poco más formal que el otro. Como una forma más formal de hacer la pregunta. ¿O no. La verdad que no. Uh -huh. no. Uh -huh. Ambos pueden ser usados. Uh -huh. ¿No? Y está el otro que es should. El should. Should is for suggestions. ¿Verdad? ¿No? Acá lo teníamos, ¿no? Should is for suggestion. ¿No? Yo quiero sugerir algo. O sea, se conoce como advice, dar algún consejo. ¿Verdad? Yo uso el should. Hola. Ah, Pero eso es solo como para responder. Uh, ¿Puedo hacer preguntas? También. Uh, sí. No, no. ¿Y la traducción de show sería? Uh, ¿Te gustaría? 
este. Hacer un, un debería. Debería. ¿Verdad? Pero ese es, es porque el debería nosotros podemos traducirlo en diferentes. No, hay varias palabras que en español las venimos traduciendo igual, como debería, pero que en inglés tienen diferente fuerza. Por ejemplo, no es lo mismo que yo, que yo le diga, you should go to the doctor. No, you should, o que yo le digo, you should come early. ¿Verdad? A que yo le diga, you must come early. Ya, y, y prácticamente si lo traducimos, lo traduciríamos igual. Tú deberías venir temprano. O quizá variaríamos en, al traducir que el must es ya una obligación. ¿Verdad? Tú debes venir temprano. ¿No? Pero eh, ya el, el should no, no le estoy dando una orden, no lo estoy obligando, no. El should es una, una suggestion, una idea, un advice. ¿Verdad? No, no. Y para pedir algún consejo, por ejemplo, usted quiere saber, mira, mira, eh, vos crees vos que yo debería comprar tal cosa. Uh -huh. Anda, ahí lo pudiéramos usar. Oh, yo. Y ese va con el verbo en, en sentido base. Sí. En base form. Ajá. Siempre. ¿Verdad? Usamos should o shouldn't, que sería la forma negativa, con el verbo en base form. ¿Ve? Shouldn't use, shouldn't speak, shouldn't tell, shouldn't shout. Lo mismo acá, en afirmativo. Should answer, should greet, should use, should say. No. Oh. Si usted quisiera hacer una pregunta, pudiera ser. Um, should I um, go to the doctor? Debería, debería ir al doctor. Debería yo ir al doctor. No. Las preguntas no se pueden hacer en negativo, ¿verdad? Sí, ¿cómo no? Shouldn. Así sería. Shouldn't Should I go to the doctor? Ajá. Yo no debería ir al doctor. No, eso no es pregunta. Así como lo entonó, no suena pregunta. Shouldn't I go to the doctor? Ajá. Oh. Ah, los, los tres casi que se parecen, ¿verdad? No podrías, deberías. Podrías, te importaría, debería. Bueno, más o menos, no tan. No tan. <risa> <risa> Ya, yeah, sí, porque el, el could tiene otros usos también, pero no es uh -huh. eso, lo que hemos visto acá. Uh -huh. Solo lo hemos visto como esta manera de hacer esa pregunta. Vale. Es como, ya, yeah, como solicitar algo, como un permiso también. Cool. Could. No, no, cool. Could. Could. Ese quizás era lo que tenía como un poquito de duda. Y ahí a otros sistemas de vocabulario. Yo cuando me preguntan, ya me pongo nerviosa porque a veces cuando me sé una palabra, 
siento que no logro armar las oraciones. Me, me, sí, me hay, hay. <risa> hay que buscarle el helado. Si, sí. no, si no se haya una, tiene que, se puede encontrar otra. Sí. Pues sí. <risa> ok, Jenny. Ten minutes are over. Se van rapidísimo, ¿no? Diez minutos. Sí. Thank you, teacher. Ok, you're welcome. Have a good night. Ok. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.